What's going on YouTube? This is Inventory King coming at you with a video in front of 220. Uh, I have um, been thinking today about do we really watch our African cichlids? Um, of course we all sit on the couch and enjoy our cichlids or wherever it is that we may be. Uh, you know, we're enjoying our fish tanks. Uh, it's what we do. Um, but what I want to know is do we pay attention to the fish? To their body, to their fins, to their breathing, uh, whether they're scratching up against things. Are we really watching them? So here's what I meant by do we really look at our fish? When I'm looking at my African cichlids, I look at them every day. Um, sometimes I can look, oh my gosh, look at that blaze. Um, sometimes, um, I could look at them better, but the point I'm trying to make is I look at their, their bodies. Look at that blue dolphin. I look at their bodies, their fins. You don't want to know why? Because if we pay attention to our fish in detail, look at their fins, look at their bodies, look at how they're breathing, look at if they're scratching up on stuff, that's going to be our telltale sign if something's going on with our fish and if we could catch it prior to it becoming something that is going to be extremely tough to stop or it might be impossible to stop. So anytime I see any white marks on their body, what I like to do is look at it. If I see it waving around, then I know they just got hit as far as I can tell. And it's not going to be ick. But if there's a white spot and it's not moving, I kind of start getting concerned, start looking a little bit more at the fish to tell whether it's a sickness or not. Uh, on their fins, same thing. If you see, you know, I see little white marks on their fins. Sometimes it's just because it healed wrong or when they got nipped by other fish. Uh, when they scratch, I like to look at their body, again, for the purposes of ick, because you don't want your tank to get full of ick. So that's kind of why I'm thinking, do we really look at our fish? Because we could help prevent outbreaks by paying attention to our fish. I've lost a whole tank, except for an albino pleco and two hybrid Texas cichlids a long time ago. And um, I paid close attention to my fish. It's the OCD in me, um, but so far so good. With a healthy tank, healthy fish, Beautiful, relaxing aquarium. I'm gonna do a spotlight on some of these guys. This is my tangerine tiger. This guy is a beast, beast mode. 10 bucks off Craigslist, are you kidding me? This blue dolphin is flexing, look at those fins. L look at this guy, 10 bucks on Craigslist. Yeah, I said it, 10 bucks. All right guys, so yeah, leave a comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Um, you really watch your fish. Uh, of course, everyone does, but in detail, making sure that you know we're keeping a good eye on them to make sure that they're healthy uh, day in and day out. Uh, again, please comment down below, like, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned.